Do you have been Alice for 15 years? How do you feel about it? You know, it's been such an amazing journey playing this character for so many years. I have so much fun playing Alice. I love the Resident Evil world, you know, to be able to do these stunts and these fight sequences and have these incredible sets. I mean, it really is uh, so different from your everyday life. Um, plus, I met my husband through these movies. I have two beautiful kids now, so, you know, it's, it's been an amazing ride. What have you learned from Alice? Alice is uh, such a great role model. She's so strong and, you know, fierce. And, you know, I have to say, uh, she definitely inspires me. You know, so when I, when I wake up in the morning and I might not be feeling my best or, you know, I see that something isn't going my way or something's not right, I kind of channel my inner Alice to help me get through it. Which Resident Evil movie is your favorite and why? I would have to say for sure this one because I love the fact that Alice finally finds out about her history and who she really is. But also, my daughter is in the movie. So, and she's the Red Queen and she's so amazing and I'm so proud of her. And uh, she's just such a talented actress. Like, there was nothing that could be more magical than being on set with your child. What was the most difficult action sequence for you? All the sequences uh, had many different challenges, and they were all hard in their own way. I guess I would say the, the turbine sequence was one of the most difficult because we were, it was freezing, first of all. We were shooting at night. It was freezing in this wind tunnel, and it was incredibly windy. Um, and then they would turn a huge wind machine on, so it, it, it's just, when you have wind everywhere, it just starts getting really frustrating. And we were hanging on wires for hours and hours. So, you know, it, it, it just, on many different levels, it, it, it got very, very trying, very challenging to do that scene. This movie in particular is a fast-paced action movie. How did you prepare for that kind of rhythm? Well, you know, it wasn't easy because I just had a baby who was four months old when we got on uh, when we got on location. So it was definitely a challenge having to get into superhero mode when you just want to be in mommy mode. It was, I think, a little bit more difficult than it normally is for me to lose the weight and to kind of get into Alice's shape. Uh, but, you know, I just worked harder and, um, you know, just did my best to be on a very strict diet. And, it worked out, but I have to say, at the beginning, I thought, wow, this is never going to happen. Do you think, do you have something in common with Alice? I'm a very loyal person, and I think Alice is an extremely loyal person as well. What fans should expect from this movie? I think fans are going to love it, because it's definitely the biggest, the most epic Resident Evil yet. It's the most terrifying. You know, the monsters are really amazing and super gross and super scary. And also, many questions will be answered in this one about who Umbrella is and who is Alice really, and in a way that I think is going to surprise people. Is this really the final chapter? It is, you know. And, you know, the, the, we come full circle with the story, so and no matter how hard it is to say goodbye, I have to. If you have a real zombie in front of you, what would you do? <laughs> I would probably run. <laughs> okay, finally, have you ever played a, a, any of the Resident Evil games? Yes, um, that's how I found out about Resident Evil, was my little brother introduced me to the video game. And we would play with him for hours, um, you know, before I ever made the movie. That's when I heard about the movie, I knew about the game. I was a big fan of the game. Okay.